Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, myself. And today, I'm share with you how you can add this wrap text effect on your book pages. To learn this, let's get started the video. To follow this tutorial, you can download this image link in the description. To bar part text on this page, just go to side panel and select here this rectangle tool. With this rectangle tool, we can creating here a shape according to this book page. I am just to create here a rectangle. Now this rectangle is created. After creating this rectangle, just right click on it and convert this into a smart object. After converting this into a smart object, just change here's name to a warp text. When you change here's text, then just go to, to this opacity and decrease here's opacity to see a pass through this shape. I am just to decrease here's opacity. Now just select a move tool and just take this rectangle to a left side and take it from a corner and rotate it according to this book page. I may just rotate it here. Let's decrease here its size. I may just decrease here its size according to this book page. After adjusting it here, just go to top end and click on this edit. In this edit, just select here this transform. In this transform, just select here this warp. With this warp, we can adjust this rectangle according to this book page. I am just take it from a downside to a upper side. With this, our this shape is looking a realistic according to this book pages. Just take it from a downside. I am adjust it here. Now I am just take it from a right corner and also take it to a, this down. I am just adjust it here. You can adjust this according to this book page. I am take it from a left corner and I am adjust it here. And I am also adjust this point here. You can adjust this point according to your book pages to wrap a proper text on this page. You can take your time to wrap this shape according to this book page. I am just wrap this according to this book page. Now over this shape is turn according to this book page. Now I just increase here its opacity. Now you can see here this warping is completed according to this page. Now this is looking beautiful and realistic. Now I just select this layer and double click on this smart object thumbnail to open this layer. Now this layer is opened. Now just Go to adjustment layers and select here this color fill layer. With this you can apply here any color, whatever color you like to create on a page. But according to this, I'm just selecting here this white color. After this, I'm just hit on a OK button. Now this white layer color is added. Now just go to side panel and select here this text tool. With this text tool, you can just add here your text. I'm just type here my text. I'm just write here type your text here and press ctrl a to select all and just increase here its text size just you can increase this on a top panel just increase here its size now over this text is typed here now i'm just selecting a move tool and i'm increase here its text size i'm adjust it here and you can double click on this text thumbnail to change here is color to any color. You can just click on this and you can change here's color to uh, any color. Just play with this. I'm uh, selecting here this black color. And you can also change here's font to whatever font you like. I'm uh, selecting here this deco font. Now you can see here our text font is changed. Now just select here this text layer and double click on this text thumbnail. And just click on this and press ctrl a to select this all text and press ctrl c to copy this text and just click on this and press enter key and press ctrl b to paste this in this shape layer i am just press ctrl v to paste this text on my all canvas i am just press ctrl v to paste this you can type here any text whatever text you like to type on this text now i'm just creating here these copies now just select this text type layer and just increase here its text size i'm just adjusting it in a center and press alt key to increase here text size from a center just press alt key and make its size larger i'm just adjust it here 
after adjusting it just click on this tick button and press ctrl s to save this into a smart object now over this text is updated in our this book page you can see here to make it more beautiful and realistic just change its blend mode from normal to multiply you can see here when you click on this multiply blend mode with this our this text is blend with our this book page to make it beautiful and realistic just double click on it and change its blend diffs i may just take it from a darker area so just take this slider to a right side and just stop where you see this text is looking a harsh and just press alt key to split this slider and take this slider to a left side i may just take this to a left side i mean just stop here now you can take this slider from a bright area say just press alt key to split this slider and take this all the way left just stop where you see your text is looking a beautiful and realistic i mean just take this slider to a right side to see where our text is looking a beautiful and realistic i mean just stop here after this just hit on a ok button now have a look at it after changing its blend diffs this is looking a more beautiful and a more realistic now you can see here a final result this is before this is after adding this layer to create this warp text effect on our this book page that's it i hope you really enjoy this video if you did make sure you like this video and also subscribe this channel for more tutorial like this so see you in the next video till then bye bye